I mentioned earlier about the um, about the social media brand that I developed called Wines Egg, which has served as a personal laboratory. And I'd like to take you to just a couple of uh, pieces of it because it's going to take you behind the scenes and show you a little bit more how content marketing really works. And this is Wines Egg. And again, it's a blog. It looks like a website, but it's a blog. And I run it just like I do as if I was a local business uh, entrepreneur. And I post twice a week. Here's a post. Here's a post. A couple times a week I put up a post. This is how we run our, our social media campaigns for our clients. And I do it all by myself. And doing this now for about a year, you can kind of see the audience I've built. I, anywhere between 1,500 and 5,000 people in blue uh, come to me. Different people come to this site every month. And up to 6,000 page views can be found every month. And one of the reasons you see this kind of dip here in rebuilding is that right about here I switched URLs, which I have learned in my experience is not a good idea. So it's establishing the right URL uh, and having it as hosted the right way makes the most sense. But in any event, um, there's this audience that's been created by nothing but content. This is not a real business. Um, I just write about wine. And uh, people come here. Now, if I had something to sell, this is an amazing audience to have. Secondly is I've never been able to say to develop this audience, here's a great project that I did, here's a great wine I just made, here's some stemware I have for sale, or anything that can directly generate income for me or that can be a, could lead to a transaction. All I did was write about things that I think are interesting to people who, if I was in the business of fine wine that I would want to be selling my stuff to. So how do, I do, how do we do this? Let's talk about the content marketing campaign. We created two posts a week, put it on a WordPress platform, um, uh, set up a fan page for WineZag. Uh, WineZag has 790 people who follow, uh, who follow the fan page. Um, I also have a personal page. That's me. And I have 785 friends. Some overlap, some don't. Some are in the wine industry, as you can see, Wine and Spirits Magazine. Most of these people I know. Most of these people I don't know on the fan page. I use a Twitter account to tweet all my posts. I have 730 followers here. Um, it's a rather large social footprint. In aggregate, there's probably a few thousand people that I'm reaching with the content every month. Um, one of the ways to extend your content marketing beyond what we were talking about before of Twitter and Facebook and so forth is to, and which we execute all the time on behalf of our clients, we found it to be awesome and a great driver of traffic, is to write about other people who are doing things like you or are of interest to people who would hire a professional like you. So for